Hi, welcome to this video. Today in this video, we are going to discuss on how we can easily add multiple websites in your local host. In one of our previous video, we have discussed on how we can easily add the multiple WordPress local host site in your PC. But that method was too complicated and most of the viewers were not able to do with that method. So today in this video, we're going to see the easiest method for doing this. For doing this method, you do not need to download any complex softwares and it is very easy to use and you can do pretty much everything that you want. And you just need to add the sites in one click without creating any database or any other. That all the things are done by this app. At first, go to localwp.com. When you go here, just click on this download button. Then choose the platform. It supports on Windows, Mac, Linux. So I have already tested on Linux and it works pretty well. So I'm going to download for Windows. Just fill in your information here. Just click on get it now. Now you just need to wait. And it will start to download. Let me click on save is. Let me download. Now it may take some time. You just need to wait until it downloads. So for doing this method you do not need any other application and you need to be online while using this application but after you create the site you do not need to be online. As you can see now it is downloaded. Now it is time to open. Now this will start the installer of this local. Just choose your users. Now click on next. Now click on install. Now it will start to install the local application on your PC. You just need to wait for some time. So I need to wait for some time. So now it is installed. Now it is time to open this application. Just Tick this run local option, just click on finish. Now, when you do not have any website, then it will look like this. Now, just click on create a new site. Now, choose your site name. You can choose the advanced option and just change the local site domain. I'm going to choose corydon.com. You can choose the local path and just click on continue. I am going to choose the preferred environment. If you do not want, then you can choose custom environment. Just put your WordPress username and password. You can go to the advanced option and turn on the WordPress multi-site if you want. But I am not going to do that. Let me click on add site. And now it may take some time. It is creating the folder. If it asks for any permission, just allow that. Now as you can see my website is big added. Sometimes it shows any error. So one of the most common error that I have seen in while using this app is due to the host file. To fix that error just go to your file explorer. Just go to C drive. Just go to windows directory. Just go to system32 folder. Just go to drivers folder. Now go to Etsy. Now right click the host file. Click on properties. If this is in the read only mode, uncheck it. If it is not, then click on OK. Sometimes it is unchecked, but it often shows the error. Then you can just check this button, then click on OK and again go to the properties and just click on uncheck and click on OK. Hopefully that may fix the error. Sometimes that often do not fix that error. For that you need to go to the settings. Just go to advanced. Just go to the router mode and choose the local host. From here just click on apply after that. The only disadvantage of doing this is that you will not get the custom domain that I have chosen like coilon.com. Here will be like localhost is just slash slash. Now as you can see it is installed. Now you can just go to the view site. 
and this will open your local host you can also trust this ssl when you click it any permission or usd will be asked you can just allow that now it is trusted meaning that it will show the trusted icon or ssl when i go to my website and refresh here you may not able to see this ssl but when i go to https mode it shows the ssl there is ssl but it is not showing that for that you need to install one free plugin called really simple ssl for that you need to go to the dashboard and enter your login information now just go to plugins add new just go here and search for really simple ssl install this first plugin oh, you need to wait for it being installed now as you can see this is not showing the ssl because there is ssl but it is not forced so we'll force to use the ssl just click on activate just click on go ahead and go ahead activate ssl now you need to log in again go to my website as you can see i have the ssl and it is forced when i try to go to the http site as you can see i am being redirected to the ssl site so this is just a fake website there is not any domain register or hosting register with this this is just a local host on your computer so when i go to this website in any other device then it will not work so this was the easiest method on how we can install or add websites in your WordPress. You can also create any other website by using this method. For that, just click on this plus icon and add any website that you want. This is completely free and this is a very good alternative to the any other application for doing the local host for WordPress. I hope this video was helpful and your issue is solved thank you for watching this video do not forget to subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon thank you for this video stay tuned goodbye